Hello. Well, it's our nightly look at the weather around the globe, and the picture behind me gives you a clue what we're going to be talking about. Uh, it is the middle of hurricane season, and this time of the year, the subtropical Atlantic can be swarming with powerful storms, and we have three of them, three hurricanes, in fact. One just off the edge of the screen here with the tracks, and um, that's uh, Hurricane Helene. This one here is Hurricane Isaac, potentially heading towards the Lesser Antilles in the Caribbean. And then this one is Florence, Hurricane Florence, eyeing up the east coast of the United States. And Florence could be a potentially very powerful storm indeed. Now, at the moment, it's still pretty stormy there around the eastern seaboard of the United States, but it's nothing compared to what Florence could potentially unleash once it strikes land around about Thursday time, possibly around the Carolinas. That's at least the current projected path. But these storms notoriously are very difficult to predict. It could curve away towards the north, could go a little bit further south. It's so hard to predict where that eye is going to go. And it's just around the eye where we get the most devastating weather and heavy rain. So this is just one computer result of where it may be heading. On Tuesday across the Caribbean, the weather's relatively quiet apart from this western end here. But you can see um, Hispaniola the uh, Puerto Rico, the Lesser Antilles here, but there off the edge of the screen, you can see the beginnings of Hurricane Isaac. Now, this one isn't expected to be quite as powerful as Hurricane uh, Florence, which is just towards the north there, but still, look what happens over the coming days. So this is the forecast for the next three or four days. It barrels across the island, and remember, some of the islands were so, so badly affected last year. This is not great news. For example, Dominica is in the line for potentially being impacted um, by the storm. Let's also mention something different, Europe at the moment, where we're getting a blast of some summertime heat across some parts of the continent. Take a look at Tuesday's weather forecast there. In Paris, 30 degrees Celsius. In fact, looks like on Wednesday, there'll be lots of heat too. We're just missing the heat in the UK. Anyway, now let's go back to a typhoon. So this is the other side of the world around Asia Pacific. This is Typhoon Manghut. It's just been passing around Guam and it's expected to head in the direction of the uh, Asian coast. So we're talking about a landfall sometime towards the end of the week and the weekend around the Philippines, maybe the northern end of the Philippines, possibly Taiwan, maybe the coast of China. So here it is just around the bar and that storm is going to take this track and head in this general direction. And I must stress that some of the computer models are suggesting that this could be a very powerful storm. So there's a lot happening around the world. We'll keep you posted on everything. That's it for me.